asteroid mining could shift from science fiction to world-changing reality a lot quicker than you would think. In this first episode, we are going to introduce the idea of space mining and what it would actually entail. Future episodes will cover a range of topics, including potential technologies, the financial equation of space mining, and even some of the legal problems that we could face when carrying out this bold new endeavor. So first things first, what is an asteroid? Asteroids are leftover material from the early formation of the solar system some 4.5 billion years ago. Many are unaltered collections of raw solar system material, with a handful being debris from the destruction of partially formed planets that collided in our solar system's infancy. The position of these asteroids vary wildly, with some passing close to the Sun, while others are found way beyond the orbit of Neptune. However, the vast majority have been captured by Jupiter's gravity, forming a belt between it and Mars, an area known as the Main Belt. This belt holds more than 200 asteroids with diameters larger than 100 kilometers, an estimated 750,000 larger than 1 kilometer, and millions of even smaller ones. Outside of low Earth orbit, many nearby asteroids are the most accessible destination in the universe, with many containing enormous quantities of accessible resources. We've learned a great deal about asteroids over the past few decades. From the 50,000 meteorite samples that have been analyzed, the modern investments in telescopic study, and from successful government space missions to 433 Eros, 25143 Itokawa, and a handful of other asteroids. One of the most important aspects to space mining is, why do it? The main reason to start harvesting asteroids is that they contain all the materials we need to live, as well as to pioneer an entirely new type of space business. During the early stages of the mining operations, it will start serving the demands of current space businesses, such as communications and remote sensing satellites, improving the services they offer. Currently, the space industry is held back by the high cost of launching equipment and supplies into orbit. This launch cost greatly limits the range of business activities that are viable. Once asteroid mining is able to provide the raw materials to be used in space, a supply chain can be established, encouraging new applications and new business models as entrepreneurs attempt to introduce even more services that people on Earth find useful. The possibilities are truly endless with asteroid mining. Due to the wealth of new resources and opportunity to build economies beyond what we have on Earth today, and to allow humans to become an interplanetary species. Thanks for watching our very first animation, and we hope you enjoyed it. We are planning on creating more of these types of videos, however, with a crew of just two people, this does take a bit of time. So, to hopefully have a quicker turnaround, we are creating a Patreon to hopefully fund this and our other video projects. Even just watching and subscribing to our channel encourages us to make more videos. Thanks for your time, and I hope to see you on our other videos.